I fell pregnant with one fallopian tube? What? Quick confession, I'm not pregnant before my husband has a heart attack, but yep, you can fall pregnant with one functioning tube. Hi, I'm Dr. Nagat, an NHS GP with a specialist interest in women's health, and I'm gonna tell you how you can fall pregnant with one functioning fallopian tube. Now, let's take a look at the anatomy of the fallopian tubes. If you've ever seen a diagram of the female reproductive system, you'll have noticed two longed curves tubed, one extending from either side of the uterus or your womb. These are your fallopian tubes, otherwise known as uterine tubes. The fallopian tube's function is to carry the egg from an ovary to the uterus. However, the anatomy of the fallopian tube is actually a little more complex than you might think. In fact, our fallopian tubes and ovaries aren't stuck together like we see in the diagrams. Get this, the fallopian tubes and the uterus are lined with little receptor cells that at the point of ovulation are sent a signal that switches them on. And they emit a signal that attracts a similar receptor in the egg and in the sperm if it happens to be around to come and meet in the same place i.e the fallopian tube the fallopian tubes are not attached to the ovaries and at the point of ovulation some very delicate structures called the fimbrae at the end of the fallopian tube begin to move gently towards and drawing the egg towards the end of the fallopian tube a bit like lots of little fingers waving the egg towards it come hither egg come to me so it can then transport it into the uterus so if you have one ovary and no fallopian tube well the egg will still be released from the functioning ovary and this will then be gently called you know that come hither by the signals from the functioning fallopian tube making it possible to fall pregnant with one tube so ladies this is how incredibly clever our bodies are and this is why I love women's health. <laughs>